Hello and welcome to Zip News. Hillary Clinton continues to defend the use of her private email account while she was Secretary of State. On Saturday, the Democratic presidential hopeful denied claims for Inspector General Charles McCulloch that at least four emails from the private account contained classified information, leaving it open to hacking. Clinton is the front runner for the Democratic nomination, but a recent poll revealed the majority of voters find her untrustworthy, a problem surely exacerbated by the email controversy. Republicans continue to attack her in the issue, accusing her of intentionally trying to avoid disclosure laws through the use of her private systems, though Clinton has repeatedly denied breaking any rules. While Clinton battles to regain trust, Donald Trump continues to go from strength to strength, topping the latest CNN poll of the 2016 Republican presidential field. Despite a number of vulgar and controversial statements since announcing his candidacy, Trump was backed by 18% of Republicans in the poll, ahead of previous frontrunner Jeb Bush on 15%. On CNN's State of the Union, Trump said that he was leading a movement of Americans who were tired of the status quo in Washington and the lack of progress on the Hill. Trump's increased popularity has come despite a number of strange and at times offensive stunts. Last week, he gave out the personal phone number of fellow Republican hopeful Senator Lindsey Graham, which followed on from distasteful remarks about Mexican immigrants. Trump has also belittled John McCain's war record and launched a number of personal attacks on opponents. Analysts expect that Trump will fade away as soon as the debates and policy aspirations begin. But if there's anything to be learned from Donald Trump, is to expect the unexpected. I'm Jack Fuller, see you next time.